What's happening, everybody? Jeff Lights Jr. here with the Ball Sports Network. Thank you guys for the continued support. Continue to hit the like, share, subscribe, and the notification bell because I upload videos every single day. Now, Kevin Durant is talking again, and Kevin Durant, I'm going to just go ahead and put this out there because this is what I believe, and there's nobody that can convince me anything differently. He is the most insecure superstar athlete that I've ever seen in my life. Like, he has to be the most insecure, not just basketball player, but literally elite level athlete, rich and famous elite level athlete that I have ever witnessed. Now, I'm not that old, but still, I mean, this is incredible. So now the latest thing that Kevin Durant is saying, obviously LeBron won the finals, the Lakers won the finals, LeBron won his fourth finals MVP, and everybody's talking about LeBron and talking about how he has reestablished himself as if it ever was gone, but reestablished himself as the best player in the NBA, the best player in the world, and to a lot of people, the best player they've ever seen play basketball. And so, obviously, this is just killing Kevin Durant. You know, it's not killing nobody else, but it's really eating up Kevin Durant. And so now, he has come out and said, if LeBron James is the be how is LeBron James the best player in the world? Oh, well, it was that y'all saying LeBron James is the best player in the world, but I beat him two times in a row for fine in the finals. So what does that make me? It's like it makes you Kevin Durant, dude. You joined a 73 win team. We get it. You are great. You are all time great. Like Kevin Durant, all time is like a top 15 talent, like a top 10, top 15 player. All time, like he, he, I mean, I'm not putting that past him. He's literally, I think Kevin Durant, when it's all said and done, is a top 15 player to ever play basketball. But you ain't LeBron James. Like you are not LeBron James. It is, oh, and that's okay. Like just how people try to tell me LeBron James ain't Jordan. He's better than Jordan, but whatever. You know, you are entitled to your own opinion. But LeBron James, every time somebody say Jordan's the best, Jordan's the best, LeBron ain't coming back out and saying, well, I did this and I did that. Yeah, LeBron thinks he's the best to ever do it. And there's no problem in that. But you don't got to use another man's name to up yourself, to big up yourself. I get it. That's what fuels Kevin Durant. Like, that's what makes him go out there and want to play harder. And that's like kind of the chip that he has on his shoulder because he's pretty much accomplished everything that you can do in basketball. But you, I mean, it's okay. You're not LeBron. But it, but going at people and, and being upset that people's calling LeBron the best, just go out and prove it on the court. You have a legit chance to prove that you are better than LeBron James. It was going to be hard to prove that you were better than LBJ when you joined a 73-win Warriors team. I don't care if you won 10 championships in a row. It was going to be hard to prove that you were better than LeBron when that team had a championship and that team won 73 games the year year before you came they had a championship two years before and they were in the finals in game seven of the finals and 73 regular season wins an all-time NBA record before you joined so people that are stuck in their ways and people that just watch basketball were never going to say no matter how many championships you won even though they're valid they're legit championships you were the finals MVP you won those championships you helped put that team over the top but they're saying that you had to join that team and that team needed you to get over who the king LeBron James and that's why they're not going to give you the credit you feel like you deserve. So now you are in the Eastern Conference. Now you are at Kyrie Irving. Now you have a chance to prove once and for all that you are better than LeBron James. It's tough. It's going to be tough because you are coming off an Achilles injury. It is going to be hella hard. But you have that opportunity. Go out there and let your play speak for you. Don't use Twitter. Don't use burner accounts. Don't go through the media. It doesn't matter. Quit being so insecure. Just go out and hoop. Just go out and hoop and prove to the world that, yes, I am the best. Because they weren't willing to give it to Kawhi. So, you, to me, Kevin Durant is 10 times better than Kawhi Leonard. I mean, what, maybe not 10 times, but he's better than Kawhi Leonard. So, they were willing to give it to Kawhi because LeBron wasn't there and he went out there and handled his business. If you do what you're supposed to do with Kyrie Irving, there's no reason why people wouldn't be able to give it to you. A lot of people already think you're the best. Just go out and hoop, dude. <laughs> Man, just go out and do it. It's literally, that's all you got to do is just go out, hoop, win, and, and it'll all handle itself. But being on Twitter and talking to media and getting mad at folks because they're saying LeBron's better, that does nothing and just continues to prove insecurity on your part. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Once again, I'm Jeff Lighty Jr. with the Ball Sports Network. I'll see you next time.